Yo, what is good, YouTubes? This is your boy in the NYC. It's me, Ray, and this is the EDCC. That is the Everyday City Carry, and we have got a late one. We've got a late one today because it's nighttime right now. Usually doing these in the morning, but I wanted to crank out an unboxing. This came from Daily Carry Solutions via the Apex Pass Round Group. So I am going to expect packing peanuts in this, which is a bummer. I'm going to be using the Booze Blades Mini Smoke submitted by Ohio Knife Lover. I am in love with this thing. Uh, he's been really cool supporting the channel like crazy. He's got a couple of things um, that are going to be sent in pretty soon. And I'm like, damn. Yo, that's a homie, bro. That's a homie right there. Damn, Daily Carry Solutions with the packing peanuts, bro. I swear, I don't know why he uses these things. You know what I mean? Damn, bro. Damn, bro. You know, if I'm a little bit low end, low energy, that's because it is nighttime, man. Been up since 5 a.m. I want to say it's like 10 something right now. What do we do with this? Just like that, boy. Put that to the side. We have got an artisan cutlery. Oh man, this is gonna be awesome. Um, I think I know what it is, but let us just check it out. Let's just get right into it. You get your artisan cutlery little thing here. Let me read this. It says Damascus, and it says 182.1NL. I don't know which one that is. Ceramic ball bearings, G10 scales, CNC machine. That's the process on it. You got your card and maintenance, care and maintenance. So you've got your uh, artisan cutlery piz ouch, your pouch right here. And look what it is. Holy crap, bruh. Oh, shit, this is crazy. What the fuck? All right, let us, um, let's put that in there, right? Eh? Let's put that in there. And just put this to the side a little bit, you know what I'm saying? <clears throat> I don't know what this is. <laughs> um, it's the Archeo, I know that. So I guess this is to lock it. Wow, that is interesting. What? Look at that. <laughs> what is happening right now? <laughs> That's crazy. Um, so I guess you take it out to unlock it. All right, so first we've got G10 scales, pop of color on the pivot. It's purple, which is dope. And yeah, let's open it up. Holy crap. So this is the non-locking Archeo. Wow, look at that. It's kind of like got a double detent thing. Kind of like the um, EWC from, I think it's Monterey Bay Nines, right? If I'm not mistaken. So the... Uh, the double detent system is pretty good on this one. I don't think it's as good as on the EWC. Actually, maybe you just got to get used to it. Let's see. Let me try it. <laughs> yeah, it's, it's not as smooth for sure, but I do like it. Holy crap, look at this. Look at that thin ass, like, pocket clip. Weird, huh? And purple backspacer, too. So that's crazy. There's no detent on it. There's no detent, bro. You got um, Damascus blade here. You got the Dylan Mallory symbol right there. Wow, this is crazy. Did I move this? No, I didn't. Wow, check out that blade right there, bro. That's pretty cool. So let's uh, let's do some action shots. Like, let me try that. So you gotta push down, like kind of right here where the jumping is, and I think you'll get a nice. I don't know. I'm not so good at it. Maybe higher, like here. And then you, you can slam it down if you go, like, up there. Yeah, that seems to work better. Wow, that's crazy. That's insane that there's an Archeo that's like that. These are, I think this is the Contour G10. Very nicely contoured. Very pretty knife, actually, man. Let's just take a look at it for a little bit. Damn, I really like the, the the Damascus. I'm not a big Damascus dude. I don't know if you guys are, but you guys know that I do like this blade shape. I have the um, small Archeo in copper and the Contour G10 Archeo, small Archeo too. And I've gotten to try out the Titanium small Archeo. Now I've got to try this one, the regular size Archeo right here, which is pretty dope. Um, no weight reduction. Interesting, is there? No, 
I wonder how much this is. I don't know. I would have flashed it on the screen already. But, um, I gotta be at least a hundo, right? 100 something, 140, right? Damascus, G10. I'm assuming this is a titanium clip that's anodized. You got, um, maybe a, a titanium backspace or two. And, oh, there's that thing that I want to try right now, which I've been... So I can get, I can force my meat into here, which is something that I've been checking um, knives for uh, recently is because I cut myself, uh, as you can see right there. But this is a very pretty knife, yo. Holy crap. The double detent thing, um, I think it's kind of just okay. Let me see some. Can you lock it so it doesn't go down? Oh shit, that's cool. So you've got this like safety feature. Look at that. When you put this little bar there, let's pull it out. Oh shit, that's crazy. Imagine it just breaks and goes like snaps into my hand right now. Pretty cool. I definitely like that feature. Pretty awesome, man. Wow, this is so cool. <laughs> I don't know what to say about it. Uh, aside from it's really pretty and it's going to go to Instagram tomorrow. <laughs> and probably in my pocket. Damn, look at that though. It's pretty large, huh? Definitely uh, over the limit. I'm going to assume this is 3.5 inches. Very cool knife, guys. What do you guys think? Uh, the small Arkeo double detent. The non-locking Arkeo. With this fancy manual locking system it's like magnetic or something that's crazy uh let us do a knives up because i've been rambling on for like eight minutes already <laughs> yeah man um yeah pretty cool marks for me um definitely gonna do a follow-up video on this and we can have fun with this very cool this is the artisan cutlery non-locking archeo you got the Booze Blades Mini Smoke. You got the Blade Chops Yojimbo 2, Spider Co. And the Tucson TS232 submitted by Winchester Inc. This is your boy in the NYC. It's me, Ray, and this is the EDCC saying peace. Yo, don't forget to hit that subscribe button and don't forget to hit that bell icon so we can squat up in the comments.